Yo, what's going on YouTube? It is OG and we're getting right into it today. So uh, I didn't expect to get a game, but we did. Uh, so good timing with that. And uh, yeah, we're going to be going through the draft phase. They got Corey on the other team. Crystal Arcade, what a band like Shelly, I think. Squeak's a really good band here too. Squeak kind of beats like every lane pretty much. I think Stu can beat it, but besides that, okay. Um, And then, I don't know, we could just, Gus is probably the best mid. Maybe we'll just do Gus really fast. I forget where Gus is, there it is. Um, but yeah, like, I think pretty decent bands. I'll probably go Dog, but I think that's fine. Dog's like a strong lane, but we can definitely get something that like last pick counters it. Bro. <sighs> Twitch chat hating on my YouTube. I prefer you guys YouTube, don't worry. Alright, so let's see what they go. Dog, yeah, it's pretty typical. Um I feel like Penny's not bad here. Oh yeah, you can go Mr. P. Mr. P is probably fine too. I don't think we go stew yet because if we go mr p they can't really go stew so we should take a mid i might just go janet we're a little weak to tanks but we could always like last pick um i don't want to go gene because they have dog bags already so i think it's between like janet and max i don't really like max here i think i'll just go janet to be honest um i think this is my server too they, do they have a eu player suffo i know is eu i don't know about the other one but all right, they went Penny, that's fine. Mr. P is like kind of decent into Penny. It's like a weird thing. Like the kind of like counters yourself with the penguins, but like you can take out the mortar with the bounce shot. So I think they're kind of even overall. And he's gonna go the cringe new broken Cordelia Sprawler. Casual player, please don't go the Frank. Y you can go a lot of things here. Do not go the Frank casual player. He's gonna go the Frank, is he? Otara, that's not bad. We need something for Cordelius, I think, so. I'm not opposed to it. It's better than the Frank. Alright. Uh, I'm gonna put vision gear on just so I can pitch a lane at the start and then shield gear. But okay, Mr. P's got vision. Tara doesn't. I think I kinda want Mr. P to win lane more than I want Tara. Tara is like hit or miss, so I'm gonna like try pinching the Mr. P, I think. If we can get early porters, it's really good. And I wanna get like the dog preferably out of lane. But I'm gonna pinch the Mr. P. Alright, I gotta go through mid here because they're not going as aggro as like me to pinch. What? <sighs> this guy hit me from across the map with it? Okay, cool. Alright, just spawned in on Corey's head. He's probably pretty confused about what happened there, but we did manage to kill it. And unfortunately, he's gonna go for his treat, so I'm gonna watch that. He's gonna have to get shot if he wants it. Fortunately, I do die. Um, I don't think they'll be able to get the gems, but you know, it'd be nice if we can get some porters or the penguin in lane over here. Um, all right. I think I just kind of have to focus on myself at this point. It, oh, okay, yeah. Definitely, I'm gonna have to try playing for myself in this one. It's kind of hard. They're treated up, and they do have like Cordelius. Uh, super as well, so I always got to be careful about him sniping me like that. I do trade with him. He was traded up. He used a super, but uh, yeah, like ideally, <laughs> I get a little bit more from my team. Like maybe like hit a tarpal this game, or like you know, maybe some penguins would be cool too. I'm just gonna fly. I knew he'd try supering me, um, and I don't think there's any way I can really reset this he has tarpal i don't know why he's pulling the cordelius that was shielded all right true i'm gonna put i loki could reset but no so honestly like usually i'm passive aggressive but my team was kind of like non-existent there to be honest i don't know how we lost like two lanes that our brothers are good into and we got the lanes right but it happens sometimes Game 2 LS. I think I'm actually just going to focus mid though. I can bully the penny. And I think that might be our win condition. I 
put a regen here. Janet's not the tankiest. Corey's gonna push up. I'll just put this over here. Corey can't like really push up without getting seen. It's not really useful into the penny at all. Nice. Doing a lot better this game. Okay, so good job for my lanes this time. They're doing much, much better. They just need a warm-up game. We're a game two kind of team. And once I have fly, I'm pretty safe. Holy. All right, the Cordelius thing is very silly, but it kind of worked out in their favor sometimes. Sometimes when you get Cordelia supers, you can just make like really cool plays like that. Uh, is it our side? I'm gonna fly and get that. Okay, I hit Quarry once, so he's gonna be one shot, and I can drop this over here. Just to, uh, anyone wants to pull up, then they'll get ticked down a little bit and a little vision, but I think it's fine. My lanes will played really good that game, so yeah, they made that game a lot easier. All right, so I'm gonna focus mid again. If I see the Penny pinching, then I'll probably try pinching, but Janet does outrange Penny, and I do have vision on her, so it should be fine. I think we went for a lane switch, but it didn't work out too well. But I mean, he won lane. Both my lanes won lane. I think the dog should probably beat the Taro, but casual player is that guy. Take notes, Corey. I'm just gonna drop this here. It's something for them to focus on, kind of. So I really need my fly, because if Cordelius gets me, I think I'll probably die most of the time. So I'm going to be careful of that. And he did snipe me across the map a few times. So, But we're definitely bullying like the mid really hard here. Alright, so we need two more. We can just play it slow, as long as we like don't lose all our control. It's fine if they get a few gems. We want to get the ones that spawn on our side, though. Don't want to use my fly unless I have to, so nice. We managed to get that one. Don't know what's happening with Cordelius. I'm going to like hang over to this side, just because he can chain super suit. Yeah, he so he has his super again. Let me see if I can get core, maybe. So I did hit him. It's fine. I think I can get this and get out, honestly. I don't want to use my fly if I don't have to here. <sighs> no way! That is so ridiculous. I cannot believe that. Sprawler is so broken, guys. Like, so broken. Alright, nice. Oh my god, I got scared for a sec. I thought <laughs> I thought that was all the gems and like I had to see you in the back, right? Alright, we got the we got the window. Alright guys. Game number two. We have a pretty good team. Well, casual player is okay sometimes, but second's kind of goat, so you know. I'm gonna ban Shelly. I think it's really strong if you second pick it here. Um and I don't think it's first pickable. Because you can get like triple countered. If you first pick Shelly, but I think it's a really strong second pick, like, and it kind of messes up the draft. So right now Nani is open. I'm probably just going to go Nani. Uh, Nani and Piper both open, and if I take Nani, then they can't really go Piper. Wait, am I blind? Where's Nani? Okay, okay. Honestly, like, I'm so bad at finding Brawlers. But yeah, that's also, like... Nani into Shelly's a little rough. Oh, Toonie. The Instalock Piper. So you probably don't want to do that. Like, if I go Nani, you want to go, like, high HP. Like, I'd probably take, like, something, like, mid. Like, I mean, you could go Carl mid and then, like, something like Bonnie lane or, like, Gus lane or RT lane. RT is really good. Probably that. But casual player, please go mid. Please go something that is, like, a mid brawler. Honestly, he can go mag mid. It's not the worst, but. We need something for mid, because we have two lanes. RT and Piper can go either way, honestly, but I should clap the Piper. Um, but Toonie's very good, too, but it's like a hard counter, kind of. You just return to center the gadget. So he went Carl. I think that's good. Um, they can't really go, like, Fang or anything. RT and Nani are both pretty good into Fang. If they do go Fang, I think it's fine. Um, the only thing with Carl is, like, Grom's open, but Carl, like, hard counters it. Um, but you can kind of just like 
get pegged the whole game. Casual player is delusional if he thinks he's getting this Nani. He will not be touching this brawler. Um, but yeah, I think, uh, like, we definitely have comp here. So typically the right side's better, and I'm going to try going there. But um, I, I do want to be on the Piper, but I can also, like, pinch mid and, okay. So I got the Piper. So I think the Piper thought I'd probably go the other side to try matching her. Um, and I did not. I got stuck in a wall. I do have to be careful of the Grom. And I can slowly kind of work up to Nani Head. But I don't want to get pinched there, so I'm just going to take my time. Don't want to waste any gadgets either if I can. He's going to go down, that's fine. Oh, sh. I did not mean to do that. Okay. I think that's like a... Oh, that's actually a really good trade. So yeah, I couldn't really play too aggro at the start because... I gotta be careful with the gene pulling. I'm gonna go over here. Hopefully they can cover me a little bit. And then I'm gonna try knocking the gene down towards us. Or I can get Tuni to jump, and then I can circle around. But I can also get Grom here, so I'm just going to get a kill. If I can confirm a kill, um, I'll always do that. But what I wanted to do is knock the Gene down towards us. And I had to switch lanes because he does have pull. He's probably just going to pull me there. So we have to be really careful. I have three return to senders. I'm just going to return to sender a Grom shot here. And uh, get him low for our Carl. Um, I don't have enough time to use the rest. So I think I get Tuni there as well, yeah. And nice kills from Casual Player there. He played really good on the Carl this game, honestly. Um, but you can kind of see, like, the start is pretty hard for me. Just because I can't go as aggro as I want with the Grom there. Uh, Grom definitely has priority over Carl at the start of the game until Carl gets super. And then when he gets super, uh, the Grom can't really push up. <clears throat> he did get pressed by Corey. Corey took it personally, bro. So I'm going to switch lanes, the Piper switch lanes, and, you know, I couldn't do as much as I would like to do on Nani there at the start. So I'm hoping the Piper, yeah, I got the Piper again. So I'm going to be aggro here, otherwise the Piper is going to get a free kill on casual player. He's going to go down either way. Second did a good job pinching though. And I don't want to get hit here. Like, I don't want to return to sender unless it's a curve, pretty much. So I could have just returned to sender a shot, but it's not going to kill him, like... I'm going to see if I can pop that RT mark. Yeah, and he's going to be one shot right now, so he could have died there, but it's okay. So you can just see, like, until Carl gets super, this is how the magic can go. And I'm going to try hitting someone. I can't kill Toonie. Ah. So he went and blocked it. It's a good play from him. I was trying to go around, but we do get, like, some prio from that. So I'm going to push up and just try keeping them low. I want to pop the RT mark, so yeah. Whenever I see an RT mark, that's like the first thing, unless I can get a kill somewhere, then I want to... I'm going to get curved here. Oh, they switch sides. I might get pulled. Okay, so Gene is one. I don't want to risk it. They're probably going back for the Carl, but I don't want to just get pulled. I, okay, he did waste his pull there. I can get either of them here. Toonie, Toonie. Oh, okay, I'm going back for Toonie. Uh, I didn't have enough time. But I want to see if I can play mid here and just kind of shoot everyone holy nice oh my gosh my team played so good there oh good shot second so my team's playing really good i think he's marked i want to see if i can pop that i think i did i'm pretty sure i popped the mark so he's gonna be like one shot he can't push up for a while um and i do have two return descenders i'm just gonna have one on for a ground shot i'm gonna get hit by it intentionally if he shoots at me i missed I think we get the Grom here though. Yeah, I got him. So he was marked. Uh, Return to Sender does pop the mark. And uh, yeah, pretty clean game. My teammates played really good. I don't think you should ever go Piper into Nani though, but Tuni played really good on it. All right, so we got second again. Uh, I don't know too much about Caleb. Perry Hart Luki's not bad. Um, <clears throat> Elvis is all right as well. So we have first pick. I'm not gonna ban Shelly. Sometimes I wanna ban like, 
I want to be on like a Shelly counter almost, but I I don't know like stuff could be open. And I'd rather like not take the chance on Squeak. So we could have first picked Squeak, but I banned it. So it's kind of like I don't know. You're kind of guessing, right? In draft sometimes. Uh, so we could go like a lane here. I think I don't really like first picking Penny, but Rico's not the worst. Can't really get ran down, but. Um, they can go like tanks into it, I guess, like Buzz or something, but the new gadget is pretty decent into that, so I'm not super worried about it. What I'm like pretty worried about is them like last picking Sprout or something, because if the Brawler is not open, um, you know, we'll probably have to go like something mid that's not too good into it, and I can't go Stew into Mr. P, so that makes me worry about it even more, uh, because Sprout can be like really oppressive here. Okay, I like that second, Gus Carl, that's good. Like, they can definitely go tank into us. Like, I think it's a pretty good buzz game. Second's good at Carl. I can just feed him shields. And I can, like, knock buzz back out of supers and gadget and stuff, so. But if I'm them, I'm 100% going buzz here. Like, 100, 100%. And I, I don't know how the new Rico gadget works with... Or not new, but the buffed Rico gadget works with uh, the buzz interaction. But I would probably go if they do go... Okay, yeah, so. Sam is kind of the same concept. Um... I'm gonna bring damage gear just for the Sam, and then I want to have vision as well. I think vision's really good. Like, if the Sam ever gets on our side, like any of our grass, the corners, or like the main kind of part, I think it's really good. But I'm gonna need to. We have to get an early lead here for sure, uh, and we have to definitely keep track of Sam. But if we get the recon the Sam, I think it's fine, honestly. So I'm gonna just focus mid at the start. Let's. Sam just runs it down. Oh, he is running it down. So I don't want to give 8-bit any hits. He can't really get any of the gems unless I'm bricking on him really hard. But I am going to have my big shot here. Uh, shield second there. And I think we get Elvis here as well. So I had a really good shield on second. And I think he might be on the Niriko one. I don't know. But the... It's pretty unfortunate. I shouldn't have gadgeted there, I should have just died. Um, but yeah, Arika is kind of folding pretty hard. So that's what's messing the game up right now. And the Sam is in here. I don't think we can get him out very easily. So I'm literally, this game's over if I don't make a play. So good luck in spawn. I'm gonna get the 8-bit turret. He's gonna TP here. That's fine, I get him off the gems. And yeah, this game like, I don't know what happened, but Arico's not really playing the game. I'm gonna go for Mr. P. Okay, I reset it. The 8-bit had 9, but I think we still lose. Because he has TPs, we don't really have a good way to get him. All right, salvage the KD, I guess. Yeah, I don't know what Arico is doing. I don't think he was really playing the game. We should definitely switch sides, though. <clears throat> See, this is why, like, what I was worried about, like, just getting ran down or like last pick thrower, and I think. I don't know, if Rico's not good enough into a tank, or like you just lose lane to Mr. P in like two seconds, it's probably not worth the first pick for him. So I'm gonna try getting a ghost. <sighs> I can pinch him out here, hopefully. Second shoot him. All right. Second needs to gadget up and go for something, yeah, that's good. We have to kind of take advantage while he's dead. Oh, he killed them. Nice. Good job, guys. Second, you can almost be mid at this point. Gems are probably safer on him than me. Let's see if I can get the Mr. P. Just gonna go down here. It's fine. Hopefully second has a gadget to get out. Yeah, he does. I'm not gonna use my shield. 
on that guy. I'm gonna get a bunch of ghosts set up here. Uh, Mr. P Porters do in fact charge the ghosts. I need to get vision on the Sam for my team. Second, second. Oh my gosh. All right, that's fine. He died. I can get the gems. I didn't have a shot. Otherwise, I kill him. All right. Got the shield off in time. Nice. Good job, guys. But yeah, we're definitely out comped here, I think. He's gonna have to TP. I don't know how many TPs he has left, but if I can get a kill with this... I'm gonna keep him off his gloves. Maybe we can burst him down. Yeah. So really good kill there. We can pinch the Mr. P, get his porters here, hopefully. So I do have to be careful. I'm out of gadgets. Next one's ours though, uh, we need that. I think I get him, oh. Does he have TPs? Oh, he doesn't have TPs. I got him. Okay, we can reset. I'm not going for those because I'll die with the gems probably, but we have enough to reset. But we can pitch Mr. P here. I gotta be careful about standing next to a wall. I need him to super the Rico there, or the Sam there. I don't know why he did that. Our Rico's Second. Oh, second's the goat. I don't know what second did there, but this is kind of a 2v3 to be honest. I'm just gonna give it to second, not taking any chances. It's okay, Caleb. I'm sure you're good at other things. You don't have to be good at Brawl Stars. I'm sure you're good at other things. You don't need to shoot me. <clears throat> all right let's see so it's like pretty hard to win but we can win i'm just gonna get ran down second so can't super there because you can just press his gadget but nice I mean kill there you go Pretty bad start. Maybe we can burn through the 8 bits TPs like last game. I'm gonna hit both of them with it. Uh, definitely could have killed them there, but I gotta get some gems at some point. But yeah, we gotta get this guy out of here. Uh, I wasted my gadget. Kinda sucks. I'm gonna give it a second. I get like a lot of shields in this comp, but we're pretty backed up, so. He's behind us, gotta be careful. I'm just gonna push up, like, very aggro. I'm dead. There's nothing I can really do there. Second maybe got us? If he just kills parry, we reset. Nice. I don't know what second did, but... Second's the best player I've ever seen in my life. Like, I have no idea. We're gonna have to watch that back. But second actually just carried that. Like, second's the goat, bro. Oh my god. I don't even know what he did, honestly. Like, whatever. I'll I'll be his little slave with the shields. I gotta watch that back. Oh, Elvis just trolled, eh? Did he have a TP? He did. Okay, I mean, like, it's a good shot for a second, but, like, you got a <laughs> TP there. Alright, Elvis kind of got us too, Loki. Alright, guys, three wins today. It's a nice change for a YouTube video. Anyways, if you guys enjoyed the commentary and the draft, see you guys next time. Peace.